Now at six, South Florida is gearing up for another year of Formula One. The Grand Prix is coming back to Miami Gardens and with it, a boost for local businesses. CBS 4's Nicole Lauren is in Miami Gardens with more. Over 240,000 people attended the F1 Grand Prix here at Hard Rock Stadium last year. And the excitement continues as we head into year two. This event not only amazing for spectators, but also small business owners here in Miami Gardens as well, as they anticipate another big boost in business. Today, minority small business owners from Miami Gardens got together for a second year at Hard Rock Stadium to help them better prepare for Formula One. Business owners like Sean Flowers and Danielle Perry with Reggae Beats were in attendance. They tell CBS4 the boost to their business was more than anticipated. And it was just so great to, to just be able to put our business out there and show them that we can be part of F1. And I know it's international and we're international being Jamaican. So it was just great to kind of combine that. That funds that came in was a blessing. So it was helped us to, you know, upgrade some stuff and get a more smooth operation. Last year, the event brought a $350 million boost to the economy. At the summit, business owners were made aware of the changes to the layout they can expect. The president of F1 Miami, Tyler Epp, says Miami Garden businesses are their priority. Our focus is really on Miami Gardens and the people within this community. So they're the first ones we're going to go to and the first ones we're going to talk with. But we've got a full community outreach team here ready to take the calls, ready to have the conversations. Epp Adds that changes, of course, will be made to make sure that this year is an even smoother ride. We learned so much. You know, th this uh, this was a business and this was a building full of people who are used to doing full-scale large events. This one was different. It was unique. Um, we had some challenges that we overcame. For the most part, we were very proud of the team. Other small businesses like Drinks on Me 305 said there were a lot of learning lessons from year one. Owner Chaz Fenderson says changes will be made this year, but overall, the sales were great. The winner of the race was probably jumping. And so was my team. We were like, oh, my God, we did it. Uh, it was the biggest event that I did thus far of the five years that I've been in business. So I really didn't know what to expect, but super excited. Um, took a deep breath walking in and just hoped that the crowd would like what we had to offer. Now, the president of F1 Miami did say that if you want to get involved, please reach out to them. He said to reach out to them, though, before February 1st. The Grand Prix here at Hard Rock Stadium is from May 4th to May 7th. At Hard Rock Stadium, Nicole Lauren, CBS 4 News.